it's uh, one of the quietest buildings in the league, for sure. And that's another thing I don't get. Like, I look down every game and I see lots of fans and jerseys and young people. I don't see a lot of suits. And, um, you know, they've got a problem there. I, I don't know. And I, I don't have I, one of I did a Provis once where I listed all of the things that they could be doing more of and they could change things here and there. But I'm not sure how you make that, that place more lively. I'm not sure how you give it more energy. Um, the Everything's there for it to happen. There's great sight lines. It's okay, a little bit older, what, 20 years old or something now, but it, it, it's still a great rank. Mm-hmm. Uh, and you have a, you have a, a, a great multicultural fan base. Um, you have young fans in the stands. Uh, I think you have real fans in the stands. It's not that kind of soup culture that you get in Toronto. Um, so I don't get it. I don't understand it. I've heard it's always kind of been that way in Vancouver, that even in the Coliseum days, uh, you know, the fans were called out for being quiet there. Um, it doesn't really make sense to me. Um, I get it in Toronto. I can list, there's lots of reasons why. I don't think that those reasons exist in Vancouver. So I, you know, I don't understand it. Maybe people that have been around longer than me know why. I think, as Canadians, we don't know how to cheer. Steve and I were talking about it with the Giants. Well, they, hey, Patrick, they, Winnipeg is killer. Montreal is killer. Like Winnipeg yeah. is one of the best places in North America to see a game. They have terrific, witty chants. Uh, it's, it's, the, the crowd is like lively on top of the place. They're loud the entire game, even when they're down three nothing in the third period. The Bell Center in, in Montreal is much the same way. I've been to several games there where the Canucks, uh, you know, have been destroying like back in you know a few years ago that they would go in there and just wax the canadians they'd be up four five one in the third and the place would still be going bonkers so it's not a canadian thing you can't say that that's just not the case 